Okay, case needs two and a quarter. Needs to be built out right in here. Dissect this piece off right here to here. Put in a new piece. Router it like this edge is routered right here. It's a rounded routered edge. Cut all the caulk out. Put it in flat and flush. Cut the trim wood out of there. Put molding in the corner. Same here. Different size molding is going to be tricky. Inch and a quarter over here. Inch and a quarter, like corner round, or actually filler cap door molding. See this right in here? Proposing that. This is inch and a quarter. It's inch and a quarter. Over here, you sure don't get any inch and a quarter, so that'll have to be caulked, cleaned up. Just needs scraping. Caulks not even, needs to be cut out. Old paper blade scraper put in flush and flat. Bottom. Need some molding on there. Okay, what you here. Same thing on this side, molding. And molding here. Definitely gonna need a case of caulk over here, at least uh, 10 tubes. And that would do that. Side, starting left to right. The caulk's not even in here. It needs to be filled solid and flat. Take off the high spots. Same with here. Got a pocket in here. Need a case of molding go over there or something. Got measurements two or one and a half to there. And that would leave this lip. So you got an issue there. And then as we go down to the bottom again, gonna need some sort of molding across there. So over here on this, the door needs finished painting. We'll take care of that when it's warm or drop a heater over at the tarp. We've got this pocket here, cover that again. This one is inch and three quarters now. Inch and three quarters. Tricky. Real tricky. Down the bottom, need some molding. Need some molding here, across there. Close it up. You have this piece coming down like that. So, molding across there, maybe. There you go. That's the, that's the setup.